No, 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 no. My character's name is Lily. I'm not... I, I think so, anyways. I don't think we're called Freysha. I think Freysha is maybe my mom. Anyways, thank you very much, War Ember, for the support. Welcome. Dark Witch Elaine fires ranged arcane projectiles. Projectiles will home, uh, home in slightly. Is it hone or home in? Anyways. Um, on enemies in front of you. Okay. Elaine was raised in a coven of witches and was hailed as a gifted sorceress at an early age. Meeting the priestess eased her anxieties and loneliness. We now also have the witch's bubble. While in water, you can move, attack, and dodge. Yo, nice. The arcane blessing of the witch Elaine lets Lily summon spirits and move freely in the water. Some spirits cannot be summoned on the water. All right. Though she, oh, though she may fade, the ward protecting the coven shall ever remain. May you rest in peace. Okay. And that all on the first try. Imagine how many people get stuck at this point in the game. We just absolutely nailed it. Okay, so I basically... Um, I had some other areas still to discover, but I think my next main area will probably be underwater. Probably not do that. Yeah, Edzilla is here, right? I was waiting for you to show up, Edzilla. It was just so fantastic. It, uh, yeah. Look at the forehead looks better. Yeah, it really does. Yeah, it's still a little bit. Oh, look, this is how focused I am on the book. <laughs> Classic. Let's see. The Dark Witch Elaine. Fires ranged arcane projectiles. That's pretty good. Sure, I'll keep that around. <sighs> oh, I'm glad I got that boss down though. Sometimes when you're on a boss fight for too long, it genuinely does go much worse. Take that, frog man. I'm still waiting for a boss to take Loco again, like Ishin and Genishiro. Bro, Ishin, Sword Saint Ishin. That guy, man. Not a fan. Four faces. It's fucking stupid, man. I can dodge underwater, actually. Yeah, but the four faces were just not fun, though. Like, Sword Saint Ishin was just like... Uh, I don't know. I didn't like that one so much. As much as I did like uh, Sekiro in general. I mean, Sekiro is probably not my favorite game. It's very memorable, though. You know? Like, the, the boss fights and stuff, I do remember most of them. I think, anyways. But I, I, like, I would be keen to replay a Dark Souls or an Elden Ring or whatever, but I wouldn't really want to play Sekiro again. Guardian Ape. That's just one example, though, man.
Oh. The Guardian Ape wasn't even the worst of it. Oh, that, that was a pretty memorable fight. Yeah, I'll take you. Yeah, I'll give you that. Um. Wait, I have a quest button? Huh? Quest? I think these are achievements, no? Am I crazy? Why does it say chests or quests? Interesting. Don't know why they called it like that. Yeah. So there's still something for me to uh, discover in this area somewhere. Hey, what's going on, Echo? I just ended up one-shotting, um... I'm forgetting the lady's name because we went through it so quickly, but uh, I just ended up one-shotting one of the main bosses, man. It was sick. Everyone in the chat was like, whoa, Loco, that's insane. Well done. You joined just too late, man. <laughs> I can't believe he believes us, guys. <laughs> good, good, good. Very good. No, the witch lady killed me a couple times. But I could have gotten it uh, easy peasy though, much before that. Ooh. Yeah, I wanna be Ronnie. I did it for the content, 100%. I feel like I'm getting better though at like frustrating games like this. Cause I remember back in the day whenever I would get to a boss fight like that, I would actually get very tilted. But I don't really get tilted anymore much. Maybe I'm just getting old, I don't know. <laughs> but I notice I'm not really, you know. I'm not getting to the same levels of frustration. Mentally, at least, I feel like I'm doing a better job. Maybe, you know, my actual uh, gameplay is not getting any better, but. Um, the only problem is that I don't really remember I don't really remember exactly where I had areas that I couldn't finish, you know, because I, I couldn't, couldn't swim yet. There were a bunch of areas where I wished I had that ability, but... Hey. Thank you. Coming through. Excuse me. Coming through. Ooh, sick Dutch Loco. Hey, Dr. Thanks Feelgood, what's up? Loco smile. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome back. Appreciate you. Thank you for 31. Okay, this area is done. Good. Belly flop is OP, man. I've never really done a lot of belly flopping in IRL. But if this game has taught me anything, it means that you can dodge quite a bit of damage just by... When you're just about to take damage, just lie face flat on the floor. Could be a bit painful though, but it's certainly something to keep in mind. Okay, I still cannot swim here, huh? Ow, this hurts. I guess I can maybe... Can I maybe boot peel off of that thing? No, I don't like this. This one sucks. Okay, never mind. When you belly flop in IRL, people just stare. Bloop. It looks painful. 
I don't know. I, I would do it on stream if it wasn't so... Yeah, it would be very painful. Um... I want to fast travel around a little bit again. Let's try this area for a moment. Yeah, I guess that's true. My my character is kind of small. Kids in general don't take a lot of damage, I guess. Is there anything over here? Um, so there is something in this place that I have not discovered yet. In this room that I'm currently in. Otherwise it would be colored in orange on the map. And it's still blue. da ba dee da ba die da ba dee da ba die da ba dee da ay Ah, there it is. Nice. Max HP plus 5. Always good. Now the room is orange. I think I have to do that from upstairs. The banger piano music is back again though, dude. There we go. A chain of sorcery. Grants an additional relic slot. Very nice. Alright, we've actually... I discovered quite a bit. Very good. It's going on Rhino Mark II. Welcome. Good to see you. That's a Zorkling emote I'm not familiar with. That's a winter DJ Zorkling? You're just coming to my channel, posting winter emotes in the chat? Aye, aye, aye. Can't believe it, man. The disrespect from this guy. Ah, there's a good chance he got gifted one of those by Winter himself, though, right? That's the Winter move, right? He gifts a lot of subs to his own channel. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay, so I'm just going through a bunch of the rooms that we've already finished just to see if there's Something that I can now maybe do here that I was not able to do earlier Winter has some really good emotes and then he also has some really bad ones though Some of them really are terrible <laughs> the worst ones, though, are usually the most popular ones, right? <laughs> the butter my biscuit emotes. Ooh, was that what I needed to find? Yeah, the DJ Ling is great, I agree.
What am I missing? I'm missing something somewhere, but I don't know where. Why does Winter have two disaster emotes? I mean, I don't even have to try anymore, man. These roasts make themselves. Why does he have two disaster emotes? Why do you think he has two disaster emotes? Oh, wasn't there an area that I could go to? Man, some of these rooms are so big. Da -da -da. Look, I love the music. What do you love better? When I sing it or when the lady in game sings it? Follow up question. Why do you think I sing it better than the lady in the game? Yeah, yeah, but why? Is it because I'm the trombone champ? I'm here for the music loco, it makes me sleep. I found over the years, at least a hundred people have told me that they watch my content to fall asleep. I still am not sure if that's a compliment or not. Sources are. Yo, we need to get up there. How do I get up there? Guys, that's the thing. How the fuck do I get the thing? Sorry, fudge. How the fudge do I get the thing? I'm gonna maybe try and jump down from the top. Maybe we can belly flop on top of it. Yeah, I'm not even close. Like, oh, I have to add, when I sleep listening to you, I usually have very nice dreams. <laughs> Can I make that? I don't know. People are telling me my face looks weird, Thor, because I'm not wearing headphones. But it's literally my face. Do you reckon I can maybe jump from here? Any suggestions, guys? Does anyone see what I maybe need to do? Or do I need a new ability? I might need an extra ability for... Her. No, there's no way I can jump from here. That doesn't get me far enough. I'm not even close, man. Do I need an upgrade, Zeke? Yeah, do I need a new ability? I think uh, you can tell me if I need an extra ability. I do need a new ability, right? There's no way. I need like a triple jump. It's not that I'm just bad at jumping. Okay. I look like a human now? Thor, what if I told you, right? That I am actually a human. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Literally, uh, the same. Oh, yeah, more water. Ooh. A giant's ring slightly increases damage dealt by attacks made while on the ground. Okay, a large ring tinged with magic, worn by the towering warriors of Land's End, said to be the descendants of giants. 
Its size makes it a viable bracelet worn on the arm of a young lady. <laughs> Wait, what? That's how large they, these guys are? That was still not it, by the way. There's more. Oh, yeah. There's that one right over there. I forgot about that one. Uh, I think I need an extra ability for this chest as well. Right? There's really no way that I can get up there. Probably the same ability. Ooh, maybe not! I gotta double jump at the apex and then do a belly flop at the perfect moment. No, no, it's still too far, isn't it? The belly flop is actually not great for distance. Ah, I need a thir I need like a triple jump. There's no way. You think humans are kind of gross? All humans? I do think most humans, yeah, dude. Especially if their name starts with an L and ends with Oko. Those types of humans are just, you know, the worst. Or as they say in Germany, the worst. God, I'm so annoying. Why does anyone watch my content? <laughs> Constantly being annoying and somehow people still watch. Amazing. You guys are paid actors? Yeah, my parents paid you guys. Thanks, Mom. There's no better options available right now. I see, I see. Okay. Um, they fixed it, actually, Thort. Unless they've once again broken it. But let me let me go check it real quick. No, no, no. It's it's fixed now. It's fixed. What's going on to D Hunter? Welcome back. Area we could not previously go to. What's this? More furious blight. According to D, the D in his nickname, D the Hunter, stands for dollars. That's what he says. He's been saying that for about a decade now. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> the hmm emote really is underused. It's got a lot of potential. <laughs> so, I finally made my way to a new room that I couldn't go to previously, but... There's nothing I can do in that room right now. Let's go down Argyle. Argyle, how does it feel to now be officially old? Since it was your birthday. You're probably back after taking a nap. Your visitors have left? Oh, right!
Argyle had visitors. Ugh. Terrifying. So visitors, for those of you unfamiliar, they basically come to your home. And then you gotta be like talking to them. Sometimes you even gotta like give them food and, and things to drink. Horrible. What do you get in return? Human interaction. Yeah, that's pretty much all you get. Oh, his parents were over and they cooked him food? Oh, maybe it's not too bad then. Food's good. You got presents in return too? Yo. It would probably help if I remember after I complete an area what happened in that area I was just in. But I honestly, I walk around this place with blinders on. I have no idea. What's going on, Echo Steel? Thank you for gifting five community subs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't need to be here. Why am I here again? Thank you very much, Echo. 257 gifted subs. It's a lot of subs. Oh, have I gotten in here? Look, I'm only two levels above you, so I'm not old. You're 31? According to guys in the chat, that's really old, dude. That's really old. If I have to believe Twitch chat, that's one foot in the grave. 32? Yikes, man. Yeah, no, that's, uh... Ah, uh, getting there. It is funny, though, because... When I was a kid, I thought 18 was old. And now I think 18... I mean, you know... Like, 18 is like six years away from 12. You know what I mean? Like, six years ago, if you're 18, you were 12. Right? 18, in my mind, was already quite old, though. Right now, I'm like, eh, not really. Man, I can swim really far. I wish I could be 18 again. <laughs> oh, no. Really? No, I'm much rotter 29 than 18. Oh my god, I made it all the way over here only to get wrecked by a freaking thing. You can't wait until you turn 18? Eighteen is a little overrated to be honest. Like suddenly you're now an adult. Whoop de doo. But it doesn't really make much of a difference. Can I? Ah, nice. Okay. There is probably something upstairs here that, that I haven't been to yet, because I feel like I would have already activated this. Oh, you want to turn 18 so you can legally emigrate? Okay, I see.
Yeah, the music is fantastic in this game. It gets a little bit repetitive. I think for a lot of these things, I just... I just... Oh, what? Thought I couldn't reach that yet. Ooh, there's a thing over there. Wouldn't be surprised if the room right next to this one, down below, is that... Yeah, yeah, it's gonna open up that door. Yeah, the maps are massive and this, the songs loop after just a little while. So it definitely is a bit repetitive. But like, a lot of it is more... It's a timer?! Oh, okay, okay, I did not realize that it was a timer. <laughs> I was gonna say, I must have pulled this lever before. Go, 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 go. It's Canadian Thanksgiving. Oh, on Monday? Noise, I think. Canadian Thanksgiving is a big one. It's where they thank everything for the hockey, the maple syrup. What else is there in Canada? The snow. Yeah, that's about it, right? They got, uh, that was about, uh, uh, yeah. Got level 21. Trees? They have trees in Canada? Okay. The bear and the, <laughs> the, the moose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Canada also has Thanksgiving. They do a different date than the Americans. In the Netherlands, we never give any thanks. Never. Gratefulness is not a, a word in our vocabulary. We just take everything for granted. I quite like this little ranged attack, guys. I mean, I only have a couple charges left, so it's not great. But, I mean, it deals a lot of damage. Got my bird. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Dude, I have no health. Uh, uh. No health, no healing. Oh. <laughs> Guys. Um, there's a thing with way too many legs, way too many eyes, way too many feet. And I have no health. I think this is the game telling me that I am not quite at this level yet. Because I can't even get there in time. Pretty sure I just need some sort of movement ability in order to get over here. I can't even get there. The door closes. The game is giving me the middle finger, man. I don't appreciate this. You live in Canada, but you're still working for a Costa Rica company, so no holiday for me. Wait, is uh, Thanksgiving a whole day affair? Is that a whole day? I thought it was mostly a dinner thing. I give thanks on stream pretty much like 50 times every stream, dude.
I don't really take a lot of days off. <laughs> but in general, yes. Nice, Loco. Hit that boss straight in the face. I actually think the concept of Thanksgiving Day is pretty sick. What's going on, Iratsu? I'm sure a lot of people don't take it very literal, but uh... The idea of a dedicated day giving thanks... Pretty good. Oh. So there's still an area over there that I haven't gotten to yet. Ow. No, I think I take plenty of time off these days. I started this year, at the beginning of the year, we're taking Wednesdays off-ish. I mean, Wednesdays have still turned out to be uh, pretty busy, but... At least I don't stream on Wednesdays. For some reason though, there's always something to do. Ah, uh, both are pretty great, White Knight. Whatever you prefer, man. Obviously, it's all optional. I can't get over there yet either. Man, I'm actually a little bit lost as to where I need to go. There to the right. Give that a try. See if that leads anywhere. It's good music, though, right, Thor? Look, why aren't you casting ESL? I casted ESL earlier this week, but I was only asked to cast one day. Well, actually, no, they asked me a couple days, but I could only do one day. Um. I don't have any other days on the schedule right now, but uh, maybe one day they uh, will ask me again. I quite enjoyed it, it was fun. This attack is strong, but it's also a little derp. I like the fact that it's like finding its own target. That's nice. There's a room somewhere on the right side that I haven't been to yet. I wonder if that's because I didn't have it unlocked yet or because I just didn't go there yet. I'm not sure. Okay. made quite a bit of progress today, but I, I, I don't know if I'm just lost or like... I didn't find this problem in previous games that I've played, but it's kind of hard to say. Like, I think I have to jump over right here. 
but I, I don't see how I can go all the way over there. You never really know if it's because you're lacking an ability or because it's just because you're bad. I mean, in my case, it's probably most likely that I, uh, I'm just bad, right? But you can't make any notes on the map, so it's kind of tricky to remember. I was going on butter puds. Thank you. Welcome back. I need Google Maps for this game. Well, I don't even know where I'm going, so, you know. I think I need to go back to the top section, yeah. But where? I have already run around for quite a while. So I don't think the bottom section really leads me anywhere right now. I would imagine one room to the right here, and then, you know, there's two areas that lead from there, right? So one to the right, and then one to the bottom, and then there's two rooms that are connected with that one that I haven't gotten to yet. Ah, uh, this game is very similar to Hollow Knight, and because of, you know, it's in the same genre. You're thinking of the, the streaming tomorrow? Nice. The streaming is pretty cringe, but you know, if that's really what you want to do. All right. I am fairly sure, but maybe there's water or something? Hey, nice, Argon. Right, so I have to get up on this roof. Why don't you destroy the red thing? Yeah, because I can't. I need to do it from a distance. I need to climb up higher, so I have to get up on that roof in order to go down there, right? I have found a way to go down there, though. Like, I, ca I can't do it like this. There's just not enough distance. I don't know how I got to that room in the past, though. Probably from the other side, I guess. Yeah, so one to the left, one to the bottom, then one to the right. Left, bottom, right. Okay. From here somewhere to the right. Oh, well, that was easy. So there's two areas here that I have yet to explore. Right, I remember this one. Um, can't get over there. I I tried, but uh, it's not something I can break yet. So I think I need some sort of new thing. And then there's something on the right as well. Oh, there's water! Yay! We can go somewhere. I think. This has to be the way forward. Because we just unlocked swimming. Yes, dude. A new area. Good. Frasia's ring grants the ability to parry once, or grants the ability rather to parry once equipped. Press RT in time with an incoming attack to repel the strike and nullify its attack. The ring worn by the White Priestess of the Fount. The third Priestess of the Fount was a, sp or was a special note and that she was... Okay. Hmm. 
I I'm not gonna I'm not gonna parry. No, no. Wait, it's free to equip? It's free to equip! It doesn't cost anything. I actually have five slots now. The sunken graveyard is upon us. Okay, this is a new major area. Signs of the ancients litter this place. Indeed, not much has changed since then. In fact, the ancients once called what is now Lens End their home. Their families, their homes, their honor, all stolen away from them. I don't, uh, I don't know that I would call immortality a form of survival, but either way, I am the last of the ancient warriors. Once I fell, nothing remained of my era after I awoke, save for my deathless pack, of course. Which is to say, I think we both feel what it's like to be left all alone. Okay, I think I'm going to save the game over here, guys. This seems like an excellent spot to continue once again on Monday. I'm going to save over here. Guys, we're back in the wonderful world of Ender Lilies. Well, I say wonderful, mostly out of habit, because it really wasn't that wonderful so Hope far. Everyone are doing good, low Toby. I mean, the game is wonderful, but the world, the world's not so hot right now. I mean, everything's dead. We are the only living creature that doesn't want to murder everything. Well, actually, anyways, thank you very much, Mass Caller, for the 51 months. Uh, I've been progressing through this game. Yeah, relatively smoothly so far. I have gotten lost a bunch of times, so that's a bit of a miss. But it seems like the game purposely wants you to backpedal a lot. So basically, it, the way it works, um, we go through the world, we see a lot of paths that we currently can't access because we miss an ability. So for example, I unlocked double jump and suddenly that allowed me to go to different places. And now uh, we came across a lot of water as well. Couldn't swim previously, but then I killed another one of the main bosses. And now Lily can swim. So that's nice. I think um, this is the way forward, because I checked all of the other options from what I could tell anyways. And Thanks, this seems sir, to be for the what only you way. do, Smile. Are you enjoying the game? Would you recommend? Uh, this game is an absolute banger so far, yes. Definitely do recommend it. Although, if you've never played this genre before, I would probably recommend something like Ori. Both of the Ori games are really fun. Ori and The Blind Forest in particular is an absolute banger. Ori and The Will of the Wisps is good too. And I also do think Hollow Knight is really fun. But if you've played both of those, you might want to check this one out. Anyways, I found this new area. There's no music playing. So I'm a little afraid I'm going to fight another boss. Oh. Not yet, anyways. The rain's destructive wake closes off many paths for us. Though we may unearth ancient relics or hidden alcoves if we stay sharp. We have new music. Uh, let me just lower the volume a little bit though, because it's a bit loud on my end. Okay, how's that? Hey, what's up, Invisi? Welcome. Oh, new enemies! Oh, these do a lot of damage. Fantastic, big fan. Ah! We escaped from the rain, yet ooh, we still failed. Okay, I got some more stagnant blight that allows me to upgrade my stuff. Oh, jeez. Uh, where's my bird? So I killed I killed one of the, the more difficult bosses. Actually, the hardest boss up to this point. I don't really know exactly how bosses are going to be going forward, but... The boss we killed certainly was not an easy one. Uh, so I'm assuming I'm gonna have to come crashing down like this from the top Red water is bad Oh, okay, these have a lot of health mostly Yes, if I touch the enemies I do take a lot of damage Get him Birdman Does Birdman stay with me if I switch no he does not I was wondering about that.
I can probably just get the bird guy to kill him. Get him, bird guy. Uh, alternatively, I could use this attack. Yeah. Which might be a little bit better against ranged enemies. Okay, so we got some proper platforming right now. Oh, no. Ooh, that deals a lot of damage. Okay. This ranged attack is actually awesome. This is from the most recent boss we killed. It's really strong. Yeah, I really like it. It only has a bunch of charges though, so I can't use it as like my default weapon all of the time. You can see in the bottom left how many charges I still have, so it's it's a lot, but I'm gonna run out before too long. Um, so where was the... <laughs> where was the red mark where I had to jump down? I think it's right below over here, right? I think, I think it's over here. Nope. Close, Loco. <laughs> Real close. Luckily, I've already killed everything here. <laughs> 